Hello there and welcome to another unboxing video. Uh, this one is pretty, pretty special. Um, if any of you have been following my Instagram, uh, you know I have a slight obsession uh, with Shenmue and in particular the release of Shenmue 3. Um, I've been counting down uh, for the last two weeks on my Instagram channel, uh, providing a picture of something Shenmue related. Uh, every day just to sort of count down um, might be a little bit obsessive but I don't care because uh, this is a huge moment because Shenmue was something that was so special to me and to, uh, uh, my best friend Stu and we bonded over talking about Shenmue um, I played Shenmue at a weird time in my life when uh, I had been living in Singapore and I moved back to the UK and uh, for a period of time I was living by myself uh, and I picked up a Dreamcast um, years too late really um, but picked one up in a second hand store and the guy in the store recommended Shenmue to me um, in fact it was Shenmue 2 I didn't actually play Shenmue the first one until uh, until I got it uh, probably a decade or so later uh, but anyway I had Shenmue 2 and yeah was home alone and just had a bit of time off before starting work and started playing Shenmue and it was it was a revelation it was just uh, I'd never played anything like that as immersive as that um, it just took you into this world and you you truly believed that you're almost living this life it was like living a life inside a digital space um, it was the first time I've ever ever experienced that um, you know, you could talk to anyone and they responded to you. You were doing really mundane things like getting jobs and earning money and had to pay rent and, you know, just and it was all framed in this epic story of revenge. So I was just blown away and hooked on this game as soon as I played it. And it was just something special. You knew even then it was just this really special game. Um, so when I bought Shenmue 1 and Shenmue 2 for uh, the Dreamcast probably a decade later, because um, my other Dreamcast got uh, thrown out, uh, when I got those new, the new Dreamcast and Shenmue 1 and 2, um, yeah, I completed Shenmue, the first one, and that was an awesome experience. And I've just started playing Shenmue 2 on the Dreamcast and then on the PS4 when it was released as the um, Shenmue 1 and 2 HD collection. So, yeah, and for a long time, the idea of getting Shenmue 3, never gonna happen, you know. Me and my friend Stu used to joke that it's never going to happen. Um, no, Sega are definitely not going to finance it, you know, considering the, the original one cost about 70 million to produce. I mean, there's just no way Sega are going to do that. And it wasn't exactly a, a hit with them. So, yeah, there was just no chance that they were going to make Shenmue 3. And then there were stirrings about maybe kickstarting it and stuff. And you, you heard about this and people were suggesting this to Yu Suzuki, the, the director of it. And you just thought, well, maybe he'll do something, maybe he won't. In years, we're just going by. And you're just like, if he hasn't done it now, he's never going to do it. And uh, then one day, my brother sent me a text uh, and just said, um, I forget what it said, but something like, just said Shenmue 3 or, or Watch, Watch E3 or something like that. And uh, yeah, went online and had my mind blown because Shenmue 3 was announced by Yu Suzuki. Um, and it was a glorious moment in my life. And we've been waiting many, many years, many, many delays, but I don't care. Delay it as long as possible. I mean, if you go from having like no chance of the game ever being made to now it's gonna be made, take as long as you want. Like, I don't mind. You do what you need to do to make that game a reality. The fact that it exists at all is the main thing. So yeah, I had no problem with delays. Do whatever you need to do. And it's now here. Um, a day early actually, which is uh, really cool and surprising. Something came through the letterbox and I was like, could it be, could it be? And sure enough it was. Um, and so in this package is Shenmue 3, a reality. Uh, and we made this happen. So. Pretty exciting.
Ladies and gentlemen, Shen 3 exists. Pretty nice. I'm pretty sure that this is the um, Kickstarter exclusive sleeve. I hope so. Very nice. And I presume that's the sort of more bog standard one that will be the wider release. Pretty cool. Shamu 3. There it is. Matches quite nicely with the Shenmue 1 and 2, I think. Similar sort of design. No map or, or anything, which is a little bit disappointing. Um, but, you know, I've got my Kickstarter stuff coming soon anyway, so... Yeah, I can't complain too much, but yeah. I mean, the main thing is, is that the game is here. And, uh, yeah, let's get cracking. I'll see you in a thousand years.